What's up, folks? This is Refined and Focus for Blood, Sweat, and Bass. Making another video on a little tip that I got. Um, I'm rigging up um, a Superflu Junior to uh, to have um, some really, really nice action in the bait as it swims. And what I have here is just some 20-pound uh, monofilament, just for an example um, on how I rigged this. Um, what you're going to need is some bobber stoppers. These little bobber stoppers from uh, Eagle Claw. You're also going to need an egg sinker, little tiny egg sinker. And I have the fluke rigged up on a 2 watt offset wide gap hook. Um, and I'm going to show you how I rigged that. But what you're also going to need is this little disc. It's like a like a suction cup it just doesn't flex um, and it has a little tiny hole in the center of it um, I ordered these online cost about five dollars a pack and uh, I'll give you the link to the website on where I got these so the first thing you want to do is to put on your egg sinker just put that on your line slide that right up the line the next thing you're going to want to do is Take your little suction cup and uh, find the hole in the center and uh, slide your line through like so. Then you're going to want to put your bobber stop on. Okay, got my little bobber stop on there. And then what you want to do is just tie whatever knot you favor to the fluke. Right here, I'm going to tie a San Diego jam knot on this one. When the way that goes, it's just like this. You make your little loop, you take your tag in, and you just bring it around a few times. Then you take your tag in, you put it through that hole that you made, the loop at the top. Grab your tag in wet your line, pull the tag in, and then pull the line itself to the hook, like so. Then you just bite off that tag in. I use about, leave about an eighth of an inch of a tag on there just in case the knot slips. I might even take a little bit off of that little tag in. And then um, what you're going to want to do is take your bobber stopper and slide it all the way down to your about maybe an inch from the top of the bait. Makes a little noise as it goes through, but what happens is that disc makes the bait flutter. It has a crazy, crazy action on it. Um, you can burn it real fast through the water you can let it sink to the bottom and you know work it jerk it just like you normally would uh, a fluke and um, I'm gonna tell you guys this thing puts some phenomenal action on the fluke um, just just crazy action uh, try it out there it is the egg sinker the little uh, suction cuppy type thing and your bobber stop along with the fluke 2 watt wide gap offset shank hook 20 pound monofilament you can use whatever kind of line you want and um, you're gonna catch some fish with this rig I guarantee it okay thank you for watching this has been refined and focused for blood sweat and bass tight lines comment like and subscribe